it's Monday again, and for some reason, Crunchyroll thinks it's still okay to release new episodes of X-Arm, so... I'm back. Nice to see them doubling down on this scene. You would think that they would animate a scene that they're going to be using throughout the show, repeatedly. Damn, even Michael Bay wouldn't have liked that explosion. I'll stand by it. That the opening is the best part of this show. I want to call him a hypocrite. <laughs> Look at him! <laughs> Fucking square this motherfucker is! What is this? There's no detail on his fingers looking like some sausages. No wrinkles at all. What the fuck was that? What were those, like, PowerPoint transitions? Why is she 2D? Oh my god. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Her upper lip is what moves when she talks. Her lower lip stays still. <laughs> they just animated the mouth backwards. Very good. I really... I'm not sure if she's supposed to be an android or a person. But the blonde girl is... The stiffest character. The actual android is smoother than she is. They all stand like this. Like they're in the default character selection screen. They censor that kiss. Well now he's hard. Why would you do that? I can't get over the mouth flaps in this show. It's so bad. Look at the lower lip. What is he doing? What are those teeth? Why? Why? Oh no. Oh Jesus Christ. The motion blur. This is the most disappointed I think I could possibly be watching the clan get their ass kicked. <laughs> Why does his mouth look like a horse? Why? It's over. What the fuck just what? <sighs> I couldn't even keep track of what happened. That was just so, so fucking awful. Alright. It's still terrible. Let's not act surprised. <laughs> it was what we thought it would be. I will say that I actually thought the story there was okay. The animation in the art is still egregiously bad. It is... Everything is super stiff and robotic and just doesn't have any texture at all. That helicopter looked like a fucking Hot Wheels helicopter. I take that back. That is insulting to Hot Wheels. I've... That helicopter looked real, real bad. No one has any sort of texture on their skin. There's no, like, wrinkles or hair or anything on any... Everyone looks like they're made of plastic. Or metal. That only makes sense for the one character that's a robot. Everyone else looks like shit. I thought the story was okay, actually. But, unfortunately, I can already see what they're doing. And this is going to be a, a villain of the week kind of show. Maybe by the end it'll all amount to be, you know, everyone coming back. Or everyone's powers have been collected. Like somebody's collected all the defeated people's X-Arms. And we'll, we'll see their, their abilities again in like episode 11 or something. So it's unfortunate because the only thing that was saving that episode was a decent story. And it's going to be a one-off story. Next week's going to be something totally different. But yeah, no, this is still a pile of shit.